Uh, welcome to this extreme transformation get ready with me video so basically I'll just be showing you guys how to achieve this makeup look the photo in the thumbnail is basically me at 14 slash 15 um, and basically I just over plucked my eyebrows I did not use any false lashes back then I didn't overline my lips didn't contour no highlighter no makeup at all so in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how I changed the way I applied my makeup and that completely transformed my look so I have crazy dark circles from lack of sleep um, for the primer, you can basically use anything you want. I'm just using a primer from Australis. Okay, I'm going to mention all the products that I use, but basically you can use anything that you own as long as it's similar. For the foundation, I'll be using a mix of the MAC NC30 and NC25 because it's now winter in Australia and my skin tends to get a little bit lighter during the winter months. So I actually have a different channel here on YouTube called Tia Obed, and the reason why I wanted to start another one is because that channel basically has like music, it has some cooking vlogs, some travel vlogs, um, some makeup and beauty. It just has a lot of different things and it was just all over the shop. So, so I thought I would start a different channel, which is this channel, and focus mainly on makeup, hair and beauty. Yeah, but on my other channel, I do play guitar and sing and I do have a few covers and originals. If you're interested in that sort of stuff, it's just called Tia Obed. I'll also link it down in the description um, so you can check that out if you are interested just blending all the foundation next I'm using the concealer by Fenty Beauty in 190 um, in the shade 190 I'm also going to be doing my eyebrows. Basically, I just take an eyebrow pencil and fill in the gap. My eyebrows are naturally pretty thick, so I just take in, I just fill in the gap. Okay, so I also use some eyebrow like gel and comb it through. Liquid eyebrow color. This is in dark brown. In order to sharpen that eyebrow line, you can take some uh, white, white eyeshadow or concealer and just go over your eyebrows. Draw a line. Oh my god, I nearly forgot about the concealer. Okay, so I'm going to blend that out now. So normally I would blend out the concealer before the brows. I just forgot about it for some reason. Okay, so now to talk a little bit about my channel name. The reason why I call it Tribal Beauty is because I belong to a tribe that comes from the northeast of India, which is Nagaland. So basically, I belong to a Naga tribe. Um, I belong to three different tribes. The names of the tribes I belong to are Ao, Angami, and Chang. If you're from Nagaland, you'll know what I mean. Next, I'm just contouring my nose using the Too Faced Natural Face Palette. Using that same bronzer, I'm just bronzing the sides of my face. Uh, yeah, I know it looks a bit crazy now, but I've blended out properly. And then I'm also adding a little bit of blush. Okay, so also add a little bit of bronzer just beneath your lips to give you the illusion of a thicker lip. So next I'm moving on to my eyes. Um, I'm just using the NYX Above and Beyond um, concealer in yellow to cover up all my dark circles. So, yeah. so covering up all my dark circles. Just go in with the bronzer using a fluffy brush all over your crease. And then I add some on the bottom as well. To enhance my bags, it just helps your eyes look bigger. 
And then I'm using some gel eyeliner to draw a line on the outer corners of your eyes. Basically just drawing a line on the outer corners of your eyes on both the top and bottom lash lines. So I basically do that only on the outer corners of the eyes. This helps elongate your eyes and help them look bigger. So for the eyeshadow, I'll be using the Zoeva Matte Palette and I'll be using a flat tipped brush. So just dab in a dark shade of eyeshadow or a brown and just draw a line on top of your crease. Okay, so basically this is also great for Asian or hooded eyelids. So you just open your eyes and draw a line right above where your crease sits. That already gives you the illusion of bigger eyes. After that, just take your blending brush and blend. So I also wanted to ask you guys if any of you got Kim Kardashian's new body foundation. Um, the KKW body foundation. It looked great on the Instagram stories and stuff. So basically went on the website to purchase them. And it was only like the second day. But they were already like all sold out. But the foundations look amazing. So I was just wondering if any of you guys tried it out. And what you guys think of the product. So using that same flat brush. I'm just going under my bottom lash line. I'm just using, also using a little bit of the lighter brown right on top of the crease that I drew and blending that out again. Next I'm taking my Nude by Nature So just dabbing some powder where I put the concealer. For your makeup to look blended, don't forget to add some on your neck. Okay, so while that powder is setting, I'm just going to go ahead and add some fake lashes. The lashes that I generally use are the Wispies by Ardell. Alright guys, so I added the lashes. I know they look crazy, but I'm going to blend it. For now, I'm just blending off the powder. That's been sitting there for a while. Just using a beauty blender. So basically, to tell you a bit about myself, I just graduated in December last year. And I basically work now 9 to 5, Monday to Friday. But I really enjoy doing YouTube and Instagram. They act as a creative outlet for me. I'm going to aim to do about one to two videos per week. So the next step is actually a pretty important step for me at least. Uh, to blend, to help blend out all of the smokiness. So basically I'm just using a little bit of highlighter from that same palette. The Natural Face Too Faced palette. So grab some highlighter and apply that just underneath your lash line. As well as in the inner corners of your eyes. Look how that instantly softens up this look. I'm also going to add some on the bridge of my nose and just on my cheekbone. Also, don't forget to add some on your brow bone. For the last step, I'll be finishing off with my lips. Um, I'm just going to apply some of this Lip Balm Slash Lip Gloss by Body Shop uh, to moisturize my lips. For the lip liner, I'll be using a mix of NYX, a Canoodle by NYX and the World by MAC. So this is the World by MAC. And then also the Canoodle by NYX, I'm just overlining. So next I'm using the NYX uh, lip gloss, matte lip gloss. Just dabbing a tiny bit. Woo! Um, sorry guys, so mix that in. I also got this really cheap nude lip gloss from Chemist Warehouse. So I just go over, use a little bit of that matte lipstick yeah so i just add a little bit of that nude lipstick in the middle of my lips okay guys so this is the final product so if you guys enjoyed please do subscribe and thank you for watching